What's great about this paper is you can use different techniques. Um, this has a regular style of watercolor, but also has this incredibly fine line, which is made with a Japanese ink pen. So the great thing is you can use different styles of media. And with this, also you can see, you can get really some wet technique. Um, this looks almost like acrylic, but it's also watercolor, but the paper absorbs the color in a really bright and intense way. Um, and you can use it like with wash, you can use it with brush effects, and then you can use a thinner layer of, of watercolor.